horse's muzzle, eyes, bridle path, and around the outside of its ears, you're going to use a 40 blade to boot up any white markings or to just clean up around the um, coronary bands, you're going to use a 10. So you're just going to start the clippers away from the horse and then let him know you're coming and kind of touch his face through the clippers so that he can feel the um, vibration and you're just going to clip up around. And you're going to make sure you get all of the whiskers off. And again, I'm using a 40 for the muzzle. It just gets a little bit of a closer cut and looks a little bit better. Um, to do the eyes, you're going to first do the top eye whiskers and you're just going to hold his eye shut and then just clip real quick. And then you're going to pull his upper eyelid up and then clip right under really quickly too. Um, to do his bridle path, again, you're going to start away from the horse and then you're just going to have him, have him bring his head down a little bit. And I like to start at the beginning of the mane and work up so that I don't accidentally clip any of the mane off. And then same idea with the forelock. Start at the forelock and go back and then meet in the middle. Um, he's not good about his ears, so I'm going to do it with the clippers turned off. But what you're going to do is you're just going to have his ear and you're going to keep the clippers and then you're just going to run the clippers down the outside of his ear um, just to clean up the outside. To bald out, you're going to use a 40 to clip out all of the inside hair as well and then maybe take a baby wipe and just get all of the extra hair out. In addition, just to keep your horse um, looking a little bit more neat, you can undo his halter and then just clip under his chin just to get the goat hairs. Just kind of take your clippers and you don't want to clip against the grain or anything. You're just going to kind of trim the longer hairs just to clean up the appearance of the horse.